Uh, I knew that when I came here, because these, I always behave badly at uh, events by the Hollywood Foreign Press, because they're more fun than anybody else. And, um, and I, I wanted to control my Pavlovian responses, um, and uh, so I've decided to uh, fall in love with Mafus, <laughs> which I, uh, I did, and uh, Philip, you know, you're, uh, the, um, you know, I kind of dropped a gentle hint the other day, you know, that I had lost w when your very wonderful organization gave me the most promising newcomer award. <laughs> And I lost it, you know, and, and it's very strange because uh, it wasn't that long ago. It was, uh, uh, you know, 48, 49 years. And, uh, and so I thought, well, maybe, maybe what I did was uh, I, I, I might have misplaced it at the ceremony down at the, uh, at the uh, Coconut Grove. And uh, so I went down there to look for it. You can understand that. And, and, I, and, I, and uh, what I found is that some somebody has misplaced the coconut grove. <laughs> uh, but, um, but if it, if it isn't uh, too much to ask, I, I, um, I, um, uh, as, as you may have noticed, I haven't made a lot of movies. And um, uh, I, I would really love to have my um, pr most promising uh, newcomer award in my office, if, you know. So I was just wondering that if a person waited long enough uh, to make uh, his next film, could that mean that he would be eligible once again to win the most promising newcomer award? If so, th I'd really appreciate your uh, thank you. Thanks, Warren. Your most promising award will definitely be in your office within a week. <laughs>